Hey guys, uh, welcome to your uh, February 2023 prediction reading for Capricorn. You can apply this to any of your placements because this reading could be about anything, nothing specific. We're just going to see what the cards have to say. Um, so apply this to your own unique situation. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, take a look at your other placements. If you guys haven't done so yet, hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post. Uh, give this video a thumbs up, like this video, share this video, leave a comment down in the comment section below if this message resonates. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective, um, who am I doing? Capricorn people, not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. So if you're looking for a reading tailored to your specific unique situations and your, and your energies, um, I suggest you uh, book a private personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. All right, so tell me about Capricorn for February 2023. What's going on with Capricorn in February? 2023 what is surrounding capricorn what does capricorn need to know and what can capricorn expect for february 2023 knight of pentacles here capricorn taurus virgo justice here libra energy some of you guys could work in the justice system here yeah could work in law lawyer paralegal judges this is interesting. Some of you guys could be going to jury duty, okay? Um, so the Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Justice, Libra energy here. Some of you guys might have a connection with Isis here, okay? As a deity, okay? Uh, you know, maybe as a past life, maybe you work closely with her, okay? Um, so we have the Knight of Wands here and the Knight of Swords, okay? So you guys might have a military background here too. You know, I feel like you guys might be dealing with like a kind of like a long term injury here that was suffered, perhaps in battle or, you know, it could be, you know, a car accident or something like that. And that, you know, it could be suing your insurance company or something like like that, not paying out uh, for your uh, uh, procedures. Um, but yeah, there is something kind of like, I feel like it's kind of like going in your favor here in a way. Okay, Knight of Swords, Leap, World, Courage, Gemini. Ten of Wands here and the Three of Swords. Um, this might only resonate with like a few of you guys because it's really specific because, you know, I feel like there's an energy where someone here is physically been disabled for the rest of their life here. Okay, so I do feel like there is a bit of a warrior-like energy here, okay? So tell me about the Knight of Pentacles here. Five of Wands, Justice. Three of Pentacles. There's definitely a battle going on here. This is regarding something about justice here. Justice being served, okay? Um, basically doing what's right here, okay? Um, because I feel like there is an energy of, you know, being of service here and just kind of doing the right thing and it's kind of like repaying you back for the work that you've done here for people. And I feel like, you know, there's an energy of feeling kind of like left out or just not being supported here. Nine of Wands, Two of Cups, Knight of Swords, and the Sun. Two of Cups and the Sun here, okay. I do feel like things are turning in your favor in a way. Things are finally, there's sort of like the light, like a light at the other in the tunnel sort of thing here, okay? This is so interesting. I, I do feel like there is a relationship that's, you know, there's a supportive relationship that you, you're you in here. You know, it could be a supportive family member or a friend or something like that that's kind of like helped you along the way here. Yeah, that's sort of like looked out for you here. Ten of Wands the world, three of swords, and the hangman here, Piscean energy. 
one of the things I feel like, you know, there is a tough cycle that's coming to an end here. There's a major karmic cycle that's coming to an end here. Okay. You know, whatever you're going through here. Yeah. There is a sense of like, kind of like having a bit of a reprieve or feeling a relief here. Okay. So hangman, Piscean energy, kind of surrendering and just allowing the processes to work itself out here. Okay. So what else do we have here for Capricorn? What else do we have here for Capricorn? for February 2023. What do they need to look out for and work on here? Oh, you get the King of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. There you are right here. Typically that's Taurus energy for me, but it could be any of the earth signs, okay? Um, oh my, there is a supportive partnership here regarding everything that you've gone through here, Capricorn, okay? This is a soulmate connection. This could be a same-sex couple, doesn't have to be. But yeah, there's something going on here. You know, if you're not together with this person, I feel like eventually you will be, be, be together with this person. It, it, it just seems like, you know, there's no, I, I don't feel like you guys are completely together yet. I feel like it's more so of a friendship, kind of like a bit of a slow burn. And I feel like this sort of like this karmic cycle ending here, it's going to lead to something more here between you guys. It's another earth sign here. We have the Kings and Queen of Pentacles, a true soulmate connection. Okay. There could be a realization that, oh my God, you know, we're meant to, we're meant to be, be together. You know, maybe both of you guys maybe served in the military or served in law enforcement or something like that. Okay. We have the Eight of Wands here and the Hermit, Virgo energy and the Ace of Swords here and the Devil, Capricorn energy here. So the Eight of Wands and uh, the Hermit, Virgo energy, uh, Ace of Swords here and the Devil. What we have here, I just feel like, you know, things are becoming more clear to you or that things are you know, being revealed slowly, you know, like I said, justice being served, truth is coming up, you know, that Ace of Swords, you could be using that Ace of Swords to cut this double energy out, okay? So let's see what else we have here. Yeah, it seems like there's an energy of you coming out of your shell. Whatever this is, ha it has been a very traumatic experience here for you. You've done a lot of soul searching here, deep inner work here, okay? Uh, the King of Pentacles, why is the King of Pentacles here? We have the Ten of Pentacles. Wow, Queen of Pentacles here and Judgment, Sagittarius energy. It seems like you guys are getting a chance to be together here. I mean, this is a beautiful connection forming here after all the craziness that you guys have gone through. Maybe this is how you guys met. Maybe you guys, had, maybe you guys both had like, you know, some serious injuries here. You know, maybe you guys pursued, you know, um, you know, pursue get, getting justice here, you know? Judgment, Sagittarius energy. Tell me about the Eight of Wands here. We have the Temperance card, the Hermit here, and the Two of Swords. I mean, there's definitely a lot of healing here. There's a lot of energy, a lot of healing energy surrounding you guys, coming from the universe here you know, coming from your guides and your ancestors here. Ace of Swords, we have the Hierophant, Taurus energy, and the Devil here, and the Page of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. I mean, you guys are definitely receiving a lot of messages from the higher power here. Yeah, I, I do feel like you guys, you and you basically have gone through some dark times here. This is so interesting. I do feel like there could be like entities here that were kind of like feeding you like really bad stuff here or information here. And you might have felt like you were going crazy, but I feel like that's ending. Okay. So Capricorn, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Share this video, like this video. If you haven't done so yet, subscribe, hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. All right. Thanks guys. Bye.